Let's look at question 3.2. Water is a scarce resource in South Africa. The graph below shows how the volume of water in a toilet system has been reduced over the years. That's basically to save water, right? The picture next to the graph shows a toilet pan with a toilet system. Okay, so we can see here that it's been decreasing over the years and this is basically just showing you how a toilet works. Okay, it's also giving you some conversions here saying one gallon to the number of liters. That's quite important because this graph is shown in terms of gallons. Okay, so we need to make sure that we can also convert it into something that we understand, which is liters. Okay, so use the information above to answer the questions that follow. Calculate in liters the volume of water used during February. How many days in February? Think about it right now. 28 days. Fabulous. By a family of five, right? If each person flushes the toilet on average four times, a, uh, four times a day during the month. I thought it said four times a month. I was like, I don't know what's happening in this house. But it's, it's four times a day per month. Okay. Um, so let's get this right. Okay. So we know that it's 28 days. There's four people, I mean, there's five people, and they are each flushing four times. So this is how many flushes there will be. 28 days, four times a day by five people, okay? But now we need to say, well, how many gallons do they use per flush, right? Well, the gallons that they use per flush is 1.6, right? Excuse the background noise, just my inverter. Um, so let's put that into our calculator. 1.6 times 2.8 times 4 times 5. Right, and that is how many gallons is it, it is, okay? Now, it didn't ask for gallons, it asked for it in liters. Now, how many liters are there in a gallon? There's 3,785. So we need to say, okay, 896 times 3.785, that will give us our amount of liters, right? So put that in, times 3.785, be careful you type that in correctly. Right, and that is 3391.36, and be careful to put in your units, liters. Okay, and that's your answer there. It's only three marks, quite involved, but I hope that you, this is the biggest sort of understanding here. The rest of it's quite simple. Right, let's go on to the second question of this sub-question. It says, state one way in which a person can save water in this context. So it's basically saying, this is what's happening. We're in 2022. How can you save water? Now, I don't know if you know this. This is kind of like a common sense thing. You can reduce the water flowing to the system to use less water. You can put a brick in the system, right? Because that means that there's less space for water. You can look at um, getting like a newer model of a toilet, which is more water efficient. So you can say anything like that. I'm just going to say, um, put a brick in cistern, right, to reduce volume of water per flush. Okay, and that's us done for this question. So kind of a calculation question followed by a common sense question. Let's go to the next one.